what's up welcome back to my channel if you're new my name is danielle we're doing another summer week in my life vlog this morning's been quite interesting we've gotten word that tropical storm elsa is headed our way i live in tampa florida and it was a hurricane and then she got downgraded back to a tropical storm so we're praying for that if you guys don't know we actually live on the water so that puts us more at risk for you know flooding and all kinds of things higher winds absolutely everything so whenever something like this is coming into town if you will we have to do a lot of prep my dad i just made a tiktok is in full like storm mode hey i just put the golf cart the <laughs> we've got all of our outdoor furniture inside our whole back deck is completely ready for the storm it's weird it's like the calm before the storm right now it's like actually sunny but the storm's on the way we've been watching the radar downstairs we brought all of our kayaks in all of our outdoor furniture is right there you just have to be so much more careful here because it's just crazy my, <laughs> my dad set up these things we're so thankful that we have all these amazing resources we have these great hurricane shutters that come down um so like the glass doesn't break from the wind or whatever dad do you have any comments on this storm and all the other windows are hurricane proof impact resistant there you go these aren't so we have all down shutters <laughs> He's thriving, not actually. Also, I put the golf cart in the garage. <laughs> Freddie wants to pull his truck underneath. If you want later today, you can bring your car into my garage. Oh, thank you. Finley is like, what is going on? Things are happening. So we've just been doing that all morning. Wow, the sun's actually like really out. Should I get one last tanning session? You guys, today just got even better because I just got a package in from Princess Polly, and if you know, you know. And this video is sponsored by Princess Polly's. So thank you, Princess Polly, for fulfilling my fashion addiction because I'm in love with the clothes I just got in and you guys are going to freak out. Yes, try on haul is coming. Summer essentials. I'm going to New York to tour some apartments and just like be there and I am definitely bringing these outfits. I'm so excited. So shout out Princess Polly. I do have a coupon code. I use my own coupon code all the time. I'll like see what other my friends are working with Princess Polly and literally use their codes at the time because I am obsessed. So my coupon code for the next month is Carolyn. It's my last name. 20% off your whole order. Use code Carolyn. I will also have links down below to all the clothes that I'm going to show you guys. I'm so excited about these selects I picked up. Like sheesh. Yeah, Princess Polly is great. I just know I can always count on them because they ship from the United States and they have free express shipping which is like three to four days if your order is over $50 US so it's pretty great in that regard and they just have a really good shipping system I've always admired them for that and they also offer after pay and shop pay to all US customers so that's really great to know too so yeah let's get into the try on haul because I'm sorry I'm just I'm just really excited you know when you get a package in and it's clothes that you really were excited about that's how I feel right now. This is one of the most flattering tops I've ever put on in my entire life, and that is saying a lot. This is so perfect for going out, or if you want to make it more of a daytime vibe. Oh, oh my gosh. This is such a great basic white tank. I love ribbed white tanks. It also has this black seam along the edges, which I think is really unique, um, but it is so comfy, and it's just perfect to wear with jeans or whatever you want, but love this tank also along the same lines i have this super sporty tank it's a little more fitted it's a racer bag i love it it says sportif and relax co i love it it's such good quality again goes to the jeans so great for summer this corset top is seriously gorgeous it's giving me like i feel like this is a pattern you would see on a tea mug or something it's oh it is so beautiful oh my goodness <laughs> i feel like a beautiful ballerina this screams walking in the park in New York City. Am I right? You could go cowgirl boots, you could go sneakers, which is probably what I would do. A little wrinkly right now, but oh, I love the cutouts. It's such a fun take on like a fun little dress. Then it's like, oh, oh, she cute though. Ta-da! <laughs> I loved the dress so much I got it in black and I do not regret it. This, I just, this is, everyone needs this dress. Everyone needs this dress. You can get 20% off, code Carolyn. I mean, the it's so comfortable. I feel like I'm wearing nothing. So put together. I just want to wear it right now. I feel as though this is something Elle Woods would wear, which just makes me love it even more. This is a beautiful ribbed pink dress. I love the halter. Actually, I think you're supposed to wear it crossed. Hold on. Yeah, wait, that's even cuter. I think that's how the model was wearing it. But I guess you could do it either way. Like a daytime situation. Oh, 
This is beautiful. I love it. Found this beautiful midi dress. You guys know I'm into midi skirts, midi dresses right now. So cute with just some white sneakers or sandals or wedges, whatever you want to do. Um, with some gold layer necklaces, I think would be absolutely gorgeous. For reference, I get a size 6 in dresses, unless it's, depending on the style, sometimes I might go down to 4, depending on. This is another perfect summer dress. I absolutely love it. Again, this would be really, really cute with some cowgirl boots, if that's your vibe, or sandal sneakers. Again, really whatever. I love this material. It's so light, but it's like thick, so you can't see anything under your dress. For example, this dress I got in a size four. So it just kind of depends. I just know my body and I know fabric and I know what goes with what. So for this, I knew the four would be perfect. It depends if it's like more of a slim fit dress. Sometimes my butt doesn't do the US four. It needs a US six. So just kind of depends, but I love it. Another one of those dresses I just want to wear right now. I want to go do something right now. This is so beautiful. The colors in this dress, the neckline, very similar to the last dress. This also I got us in a size 4. The back is so beautiful. It's got some fun uniqueness to it. Okay, so now I'm going to show you guys a couple of the sets that I got. This first one screams like summer nights to me. Like you've been out on vacation all day, coming in, going to dinner, you're all tanned up, ready. This is it. Like this is so comfortable. So this is a set I got it in a US 4. Um, it comes with this beautiful zebra halter top and then also the midi skirt and you can wear them separately if you want So it's kind of perfect as I was putting this set on my jaw dropped like I don't say that lightly This set is so flattering one two so cute. I feel I feel like a boss. It's like next meeting, please like obviously you wouldn't wear this in the corporate world because so much skin, but you know what I mean. Oh, so here's an example of a set I got in a size six because of the pants. They fit absolutely perfect. Top is so cute. I love this light purple color. I wish I had this for Miami. This would have been so perfect. I don't want to take this off. I'm obsessed. And again, you can wear them separately. We love that for sets. You guys all need this set. I, I feel like they also had different colors, but I picked the light purple, but now I think I need every color. Like if it's your birthday, yes. Friend's birthday, yes. Ah, this is so cute. Everyone needs this. Princess Polly, you've done it again. This pink set is so beautiful. I would so wear this top on its own with some really high-waisted jeans or this skirt. I was in need of a new pink midi skirt, my last one was just not really good quality at all. And this one, the waistband is just so not, oh, this is so amazing. I love it again, a birthday, summer dinner, so perfect. All right, next up we have some bottoms I wanna show you guys. First pair are these white pants. They're perfect for summer because they're nice and light. They're kind of a cargo vibe, I would say. I love them. These look so great with a super crop top, just like this. So the back looks like I got these in a size six. So cute. I'm wearing them with some heels right now. A great dinner look. Like honestly, this whole look is a vibe. So I have this skirt in orange already and I literally purchased it in two more colors. This is the first color I got. This beautiful like flamingo pink color. I just love these mini skirts. Hugs your curves, rock what you got. It's ribbed, it's comfortable. It's perfect just to wear with like a tank top of some sort and you're good to go. So yes, I also got the skirt in blue because I love it so much because I wore the orange one a lot. And I also got this blue top from Princess Polly like, I don't know, a month and a half ago. And it's the exact same blue and the same material pretty much that I could wear this as a set and it's so, so cute. Also got this longer black, uh, I guess this is a maxi skirt, yeah. Super soft, almost jersey material, very, very comfortable. Looks great just with a black top to match. A slit, you could add heels if you want, some strappy sandals for a dinner look, or you could wear during the day, maybe with more of a casual top. I don't really know, but it is so comfortable, such good quality, love it. Last but not least, these asymmetrical denim jeans are it. Like, these are great. I love how they fit. I can't really describe them. I guess they're straight leg. Yeah, I guess the straight leg boyfriend vibes. Um, got a size 6, so they're just asymmetrical all the way at the top. And I really like how they distress the knees. It's just, I don't know, I like how they did it. It's not too messy. 
if that makes sense. And then the bag just looks like this. I'm gonna be wearing these pants all the time, just different crop tops, just different crop tops. Like those white tops I showed you guys would go great because they had that black seam, so it would match with the black. And some snakes or some heels at night. Yes, so that is the Princess Polly haul. Hope you guys enjoyed. I know I did. Use code Caroline for 20% off so you can join in on the fun of some of these clothes. Okay, I've definitely decided I'm gonna go for another walk. I think I'm gonna have to take Finley if he's down. Literally putting on these sneakers makes me excited to go for a walk. They're so comfortable. I will also link them below. Nike Super Reps, and they kind of go with my little set here. I am seriously obsessed with this set, you guys, from Amazon. $28, I will link it down below. And it's perfect for summer because biker shorts are just better for the hot weather. I'm wearing dark blue underwear, which I understand was just a mistake. And then I also got this bright green one. It looks the same, except the shirt is like a cap sleeve. Oh, Amazon, killing it. I'll link both below. But yeah, about to go for my hot girl walk. I'm gonna put in my AirPods. I'm gonna bring Finley along for this hot girl walk. Usually I like to do it on my own but I know he's not gonna get as many walks in when the storm comes. I know I keep saying when the storm comes, but we're like assuming it's gonna start raining soon and then it's supposed to come in tonight, I guess is the new word. The sky is so weird right now, it's blue. And then it's gray. I'm a little nervous. Whew, back from my hot girl walk. It ended shortly because the clouds started to get darker and darker and our neighbors are out of town and need help moving stuff. My mom was like, okay, we're going to the grocery store. Does anyone need anything? I go, two kombuchas and a green juice. <laughs> Immediately. And she delivered. Thank you. I'm going to drink this green juice now. Thank you so much. This one has kale, spinach, celery, cucumber, parsley, cilantro, romaine, lemon, ginger, and turmeric. Yeah. Straw, because I'm a slow drinker. Alrighty gang, we are all orange today. I am about to head to the post office. It's so funny, I really have never done a big shipment like this. It's not even big, it's literally like five things. But I printed all the shipping labels and I didn't wanna get them all unorganized. So each bag has a different person's order with the shipping label on top. I'm pretty proud of myself. And I'll bring the bags back and we'll recycle them. We always use these, so. I think it's pretty smart on my part, so I'm not scrambling when I'm there. And I also told my brother I'd ship something out for him too, so. Big shipping day. I'm so excited for you guys to get your pieces that you ordered from me. This is so much fun. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go do that. Okay, that was literally the easiest thing in the entire world. I just brought in the shipping labels that Poshmark provided, and the UPS guys just I just had to pay for like the bags obviously that I put them in and it was, then they were off. That was so easy, I'm thankful. So yeah, I'm feeling successful, love a good errand. Now we're gonna head back and actually stay in probably for the rest of the day and get lots of computer stuff done. I wanna edit my pack with me for Miami video. I'm trying to think if like while I'm out if there's anything else I need to do. I have like so many pairs of jeans to get altered but I feel like right now is not a time to go do that. <laughs> my dad wants me to stop by his house. He lives down the road. Um, and put my car in his garage so it's safe because obviously not all of our cars can fit under our carport. The, the rain's coming and Tropical Storm Dad is fully unlocked. He got me a portable charger in case the power goes out or brought me one. And he got his ice cream from the hospital. No, they're not from the hospital. Oh, they're not from the I hospital. I bought it for Freddie. Oh, you bought it. Aww. A while ago. So I just dropped my car off at his house. He's also working from home right now. Like this man is like killing it, saving lives and saving cars. You guys, my mom's in like this women empowerment group and one of their assignments is to like dance. And so I hear music coming from downstairs. I wanna go see what's up. Oh, think I could forget you. She's dancing. All right, got a lot of work done and now I just changed into a t-shirt so I'm nice and comfy. I'm about to spray on this dirty spray. If you guys have been following me for a long time, you know how much I love this stuff. I don't talk about it as much anymore, but I still use it. This is from Lush and it's called Dirty Body Spray. I discovered this in high school. It became my known scent. People would say, Danielle, there's this thing you smell like and I would show them this and they'd say it was me. Like I'd walk by people and they said, it's just like, you smell it. So it's described as a sophisticated, invigorating body spray that smells of spearmint and tarragon. Basically, the goal of this spray is to smell like you just got out of the shower. 
So I'd bring this to my high school PE class. We just, if like it didn't have time to shower or whatever, kind of gross, but I'd spray this on and it smells so good, so refreshing. People are always like, what is that? Cause it's just, a, it literally just smells like you took a shower. Like it's so refreshing. Dinner has been served. I heard we're having BLTs, which I'm really excited about and sweet potato fries. The calm before the storm. It seriously is coming in, I swear. This looks absolutely magical. And then we got the fries. In need of a LaCroix. I love drinking like a sparkling water around dinner time. It just soothes me after a long day. Cheers. We just got word that the storm has been upgraded to a hurricane again, just category one. But it's so weird out right now. Finley is so confused what's going on right now, but he does so well in the storms, which is great. Miley used to get really scared of thunder, and so we were expecting Finley to kind of just be the same, and he's a champ. He doesn't even flinch at the sound of thunder, so he's gonna be good tonight. Now we are finally unpacking for Miami. These are the clothes I tried on from Princess Polly earlier. I just need to put them in my closet now, yay! But I need to unpack for Miami, and probably need to go through my closet and organize it because when new things come in, we have to make sure it's nice and organized and ready. So I'm probably gonna put a good old TV show on. I'm watching Cruel Summer on Hulu. What else am I watching? A couple more episodes of The Bold Type on Hulu. Shit's Creek always. Uh, I'm just gonna put something on while I kind of go through this. All right, just made some sleepy time tea. The storm is coming on in. We've got our hurricane shutters down in preparation. So I guess that's that. Still working on unpacking, drinking my sleepy time tea. Then I'm gonna get in bed and read and go to bed. So I'll see you guys in the morning, everybody. So it seems that our power's still on. Let's go see what the storm did, if anything. Alright, we're braving it just so I can show you guys what's going on out here. I feel like one of those weathermen. Yeah, Sally, it's raging winds out here. <laughs> Pool's really high, but everything looks like it stayed right where it needed to be. We're in the middle of redoing our seawall, so the only thing that's going on is this big puddle. Freddie, what are you doing right now? I'm gonna go catch some waves at the beach. This morning's breakfast, scrambled eggs and Cuban toast. Oh, so, so, so good, I'm so excited. Literally just laying in bed, taking advantage of this stormy day, watching Bold Type, I'm so content. Just been lounging around for a little bit watching Bold Type, I'm almost done with it and I keep pausing it because I just don't want it to end. <laughs> um, but I think it's time for coffee. I need coffee, so let's go make, I think I'm, I'm thinking latte today. <laughs> Latte is made. I have an interview for the New York Post in 20 minutes, which I'm so excited about. Of course, I just don't put my mug on the coaster. I made this playlist on Spotify called Hot Girl Summer. And it's not what you would typically think. It's more just feel-good music that I can go on my hot girl walks for. This song called More Than Friends by Aiden Bassett just puts me in the best mood. You've probably heard it on TikTok. Let's get the day started. little zoom interview OOTD. I just threw on this amazing button down. I'll link it down below. Normal jewelry, gold hoops, hair in a claw clip, 
put on blue light glasses, you look so professional. I'm wearing sweat shorts and my slides. Getting all ready for this Zoom interview. I'm so excited. I'm interviewing with a gal named Victoria at the New York Post, which is just so cool. Um, I know she also interviewed Brooke and Kay Bilotti, so the New York gals. I believe I'm gonna be talking about some of my favorite products in different categories, so I kind of prepped a little bit with some items I wanted to talk about. Let's see, should I do the glasses or not? That interview was so much fun. It put me in the best mood. It woke me up. Victoria was so sweet. She said she's been watching me on YouTube since the preppy days, which is insane. That means she's been around for a while. And it was just really cool hearing about her experience, like where she's interned and now she's working at the New York Post. Like so inspiring and I love meeting you guys and especially when you guys are doing cool things it's, it's the craziest thing so we just talked about a lot of my favorite products my morning routine travel tips it's a it's gonna be a good article we talked about a lot of things that could be a whole podcast episode so she asked me to send her a couple headshots for the article so i'm gonna do that now um my mom wants to go to nordstrom rack question mark don't know why but i said yeah i want to go that sounds fun and whole foods is right there too so that could be fun to do and yeah caffeine hitting so that's always what you love my dad just texted me and said come outside in three minutes does he have a present for me like what could this be i feel like he got me a green juice that's my bet let's see what oh <laughs> ginger shots i said bring a few shot glass oh you did Oh, he got us ginger shots. I didn't see the bring a few shot glasses text. I would have known. Three ginger shots here. I feel like a bartender. What you want? Um, I'm gonna make it happen. For a continued protection and good health. Thanks, Dad. Ginger shot delivery. No, we do not chase. We don't. Oh, yeah, you can chase. <laughs> we just put all of the patio furniture back out. Us two girls, girl power. And it's still definitely really windy, but obviously. The storm is headed up north, or I think it weakened, obviously. All right, we are gonna look at today's quote. I always, I literally always look at what the quote is on camera, so I really don't know what I'm getting. Never apologize for being you. Oh, what a great message. <laughs> I always like love the quotes. I'm like, wait, I picked these out, but it's just so funny. Alrighty, all the computer work is done for the day, so that means my mom and I are gonna go to Nordstrom Rack. I'm excited, why not? It's something to do. She has like a gift card and has to, I don't really know. I don't really know where I'm going, but I'm going. I don't need anything. Here's my little outfit. I'm really digging it. It's so comfortable, but it's so chic at the same time. Um, both items are from Princess Polly. These are the baggy asymmetrical jeans that I just got. So they're amazing. Again, use code Carolyn, 20% off. This I've had forever. It's from Princess Polly. It's just like a boxy tee. It's so cute, but it's like perfectly cropped. Daily jewels. I'm not wearing Air Force Ones. What is going on? Um, these are my new All Saints sneakers. I'll link them below for you guys. They are also platform, not as platform as the Nike Air Forces, but this is my first time wearing them. I just want to see how I feel. They're really comfy so far. They're just good if I don't want to always be wearing the Nike one. Pulled out my Balenciaga bag for the day. Claw clip as always. No makeup. Let's do this. One of us has to change. I know. Never We're even both wear in black. all black. This is crazy. Yes. Going to drop some donations off at the thrift store in the Nordstrom Rack, baby. And some cups and tags. All right, so I'm hungry. She's hungry. We're gonna stop and get a couple tacos or some guac at our favorite little restaurant. I literally get my burrito bowls there all the time, so we're gonna go. But I'm not like hungry enough to get a burrito bowl. I don't think I could change my mind in two minutes, <laughs> knowing me. But a couple tacos sounds like all right. We got tacos and <laughs> lots of chips. I wanted queso. We'll bring whatever back that we don't finish. Be a good snack. Does anyone else's mom take forever to do everything? She's like, mm -hmm. are you offended? I was kind of, no. 
know. I'm me. I'm kind and considerate, and I take. You know. I know. She was literally in Walgreens getting samples of products. You guys working with the lady to like. I don't know. What was she giving you samples of? Miniatures of the bigger um, tinted sunscreen that I bought, which is awesome because it's like you're at a department store. I Look know. She was so helpful, and then there was other things I needed, and she walked me around the store to show me where they were. Meanwhile, I'm like outside thinking she's checking out. <laughs> It was funny. We had a revisit. But it's funny, I, I'm glad I didn't stay in the car. I got some good finds. I wasn't even going to buy anything. <laughs> I got a new wet brush because I've been using mine for probably over a year. And a lot of my friends have this one. It, it's the Go Green one. It's eco-friendly. And I don't know, it just looks like it's going to be really nice to my hair. Nice. Look. I love Walgreens and CVS socks. Weird fact. But I like how they're not super thick, so if you're wearing sneakers, they don't like bunch up at the ankle. And then I've heard really good things about the Biolage shampoo and conditioner. Right now, I'm switching off between hair food shampoo and conditioner, Olaplex shampoo and conditioner, and then um, purple shampoo. But apparently it's good to switch up your shampoo and conditioner, that's what I've heard. So I'm gonna change these into the rotation when I'm done with the hair food because I always use purple shampoo and I always use Olaplex, but it's like every third wash I use just normal shampoo and conditioner. So this is the Biolage Color Last line. They're pretty expensive. They're like $20 each, but I've heard really, really good things. There's no parabens in them. It's orchid scented and it's it's nice shampoo. So, and I switched around because I just use whatever. She just, yeah, so this is a haul for you too because I, fun fact, I don't have my own bathroom at home. I did to Nordstrom Rack. She needs like a birthday gift or something. Yes, and maybe a, a, another a new luggage item. Oh yes, a new suitcase, that could be fun. I'm going on a girls trip. Girls trip! That'll be really fun. Yes. And I just think Nordstrom Rack is so fun. I wish, like, they have, they have lots of really great home stuff, but I won't buy anything. I just like looking at what they have. This girl has a list for Nordstrom Rack. Not groceries, a list for Nordstrom. <laughs> Wait, why are these all so adorable? I cannot wait to shop for my apartment, but it makes no sense to do it here. Like, this is so cute, a little scrub. The Barefoot Dreams blankets. Wow, oh, this is a dream. These are the, yeah, there's such good prices here. Okay, I actually do need candles. Like, I literally don't have any. I have one more in my room at home. And I love burning them, so I'm gonna smell some. All right, doing a little Nordstrom Rack haul. I got two candles, because I forgot that my Capri Blue candle's actually done. I love this scent, the volcano scent. And then I, all I have left is this little wood wick. So I saw this, and it looks like a Capri Blue candle, so I was like, I wonder if it smells like it. Indeed, it smells exactly like a Capri Blue candle. It's called, if you go to Nordstrom Rack, you need this. I will link it down below for you guys. It's the Tangerine Guava Candle from loft number seven it's huge compared to like the normal size compared to the normal size cabri blue this was 24 dollars. this was probably either 25 dollars or it could have been 40 honestly and this is so much bigger arguably double the size and i got a 10 foot um phone charger and then i got this candle which is also pretty big and it's called rosewood vanilla it really just smells like rose and i love the scent of rose and it's three wick which i feel like means it's gonna be powerful hello guys so we got back from north Rack. i realized what time it was hopped in the shower did my hair really quickly i didn't have time to wash it so we just styled what i had um and got dressed really quick we're headed to a bar we're going to this place called American Social, which is in downtown Tampa tonight to watch the Lightning game. Stanley Cup Finals, if they win tonight, we take it all. And the game's in Tampa, so it'll be pretty wild if we win. Meeting up with some friends there, and they also do serve food, so we're actually going to get dinner and drinks there. Wearing lightning colors. I also have a lightning shirt, but it's so hot out and it's a long sleeve. So, yeah, I was just putting in my earrings. I'm gonna sleep at my friend Morgan's house tonight. Here's my little fit. I kind of just switched everything up. I love these baggy jeans. They're so comfy. Um, wearing the same jeans, switched into my Air Forces. I couldn't help myself. And I just didn't want to get the All Saints dirty because it's kind of more of a bar vibe. Pop is from Princess Polly. I love it. You guys already saw it in this vlog. Sometimes under boob happens, but that's okay. I just need to figure out what bag I'm gonna bring. This is the bag I have everything in right now I think i'm just gonna send it and use this one like whatever okay. all right <laughs> guys come here come show your little bolts <laughs> outfits 
Always your mom's, mom's friend's shirt. We love that. A little bolts blue, white shorts. I'm in black jeans, so couldn't cute. cute, cute, cute. I'm gonna be hot. Are these a Princess Polly? Yes, Princess Polly or die. Tampa, I love you so much. And you too, Sophia. <laughs> Good morning you guys, what's up? It's Thursday morning and I'm leaving Morgan's house now. We had so much fun last night. I actually met a lot of you guys, which was really fun. Bolts won baby, Stanley Cup champs two years in a row. That's absolutely insane. It was really cool to be out in Tampa when it happened. I wanna go to Einstein Bagel on my way home. Got a small coffee and a bagel sandwich. I don't remember Einstein's packaging being this cute. Like, that's so adorable. I might need to do a little Instagram story. I truthfully don't feel hungover at all, but it's just like cloudy out and I feel as if today would be a really nice day just to like hang in bed, hang with the fam at the house. I have some videos I wanna edit. I really wanna watch the show Cruel Summer. I started the first episode, it was good. I did it, yay, in bed, t-shirt on. I finally just finished bold type. I didn't want it to end. I'm sobbing. It's such a good ending. You guys, Finley is obsessed with this owl toy. You can get it on Amazon. It's literally just orange squeaky owl ball toy. He will. This is the only toy he like plays with himself. Like he'll throw it for himself. He's just like you bring this anywhere, he'll come to you. I don't know why he's so obsessed with it. Look at him. Look at him. You got it. Yeah. All right, bold type is officially done. That means it's time to watch Cruel Summer, which is such a different vibe. Penny! Oh my gosh! Did you get me a juice? I did. <gasps> Thank nice. you so much. Hi guys, so I'm on episode four of Cruel Summer. Come here, come here. And, oh. I decided to put back on my Outdoor Voices exercise dress and exercise. Um, I was doing like an Instagram Q&A and someone goes, have you gone for your hot girl walk today yet? And I said, no, but thank you for the motivation. I definitely want to. I thought it was gonna rain, but it never did. So. Really good boy. Sheesh, it's hot outside. Those walks always put me in a good mood. Now I was just outside and it is so nice out. I really just wanna jump in the pool and read a little bit after, so I think that's just what I'm gonna do. What bathing suit do I put on? Today's such a random day, but that's just how it is at home. I get bored easily, so I'm like, okay, I'm gonna go to the pool. Okay, I'm gonna go for a walk. Okay, I'm gonna watch TV. <laughs> also, just remember the Gossip Girl reboot's out tonight. Brought Finley out back with me. Yes, sir. Our seawall is still in the midst of getting <laughs> fixed. <laughs> all of our chairs are still right here from the storm, and all of like our nice like lawn tanning chairs are in there, and I just simply don't feel like getting it, so. I'm gonna jump in the pool and just sit here and read. It's kind of good. I have better posture to like sit and read my book. Oh my gosh. That is an unreal feeling that I can't describe. Country music on. It's still summer, baby. <laughs> All right, you guys, it's way later and I finally I'm about to watch Gossip Girl reboot. Oh my gosh, it literally is like here and ready for me. I thought I had HBO Max already because I thought I had like the Hulu extension, but the Gossip Girl reboot wasn't on it. So another $14 a month down the drain so I can have another subscription service. So now I have HBO Max, which is good because that means I can watch the other Gossip Girl and all the things. So I'm gonna get cozy. Good morning, everybody. It's Friday morning and I just posted the Gals on the Go Friday polls. So if you guys don't follow the Girls on the Go Instagram, what are you doing? It's freaking adorable. The Gossip Girl reboot first episode was absolutely amazing. It was better than I even expected. Like, I thoroughly enjoyed it. I loved the soundtrack. I loved the storyline. I loved the characters. I am so pumped. So I watched that and then I went to bed. Our dog trainer is about to be here and I'm gonna do the session with her this morning. I think maybe Freddie too for a little bit. Um, 
she just helps us with training Finley. My friend Morgan and I just decided why not we got lawn tickets to see Brad Paisley in concert tonight and Jimmy Allen's opening for him and I know so many of Jimmy Allen's songs so I'm really pumped about that and they have some songs together. I haven't been to a country, I've never actually been to a country concert where you like sit on the lawn and it's that kind of vibe. Though my brother's going with some of his friends and I was like Morgan do you want to go? Like literally the tickets were like $37 let's go have a time and we can like hang out with freddie and his friends if we want but and then we've literally both texted at the same time i have cowboy boots i want to wear <laughs> good boy yes good boy yay doing some agility training today <laughs> and we had no idea we're about to try and do the weaving pole he might not be a show dog <laughs> but he's doing pretty well yes <gasps> Just finished dog training, it was so much fun. And then I noticed that I'm getting a ton of TikTok followers again. And guys, the TikTok I made of my dad doubled overnight. It's at 2.5 million. This is the biggest TikTok I've ever had. And it's literally just me following my dad around as he's preparing for the tropical storm. All right, you guys, I feel like Taylor Swift a little bit. <laughs> Morgan told me to wear this one. I was in between a couple dresses, but like, you know, I feel good in it. I feel happy. And that's the point of tonight, is just roaming around and having a good time. Dress, you guys already know, it's from Princess Polly. I love it. 20% off, use code Carolyn. I just love this, it's super lightweight, super comfortable. Wearing my cowboy boots, these are actually from like Rebecca Minkoff. They're just white cowgirl boots from Rebecca Minkoff. We love that. I think we're gonna do aviators. Tailgate outside, my brother's driving and obviously not drinking. Um, so he's going to like park and my brother has a truck. We're gonna hang out outside the amphitheater before we go in. And I thought it could be fun for a photo only to bring my hat. Very monochromatic look here, but we're here for it. Howdy. <laughs> Brother, sister bonding. All right guys, we're out here tailgating. Cheers. Ha ye. Got our boots. We love that. <laughs> These are really tasty. Jimmy Allen's on right now. Got a Chick-fil-A sandwich. That's water. It looks like beer, but it's mountain water. So, woo! Alright guys, I'm whispering because I don't want to wake Finley up, but the concert was so much fun. I am so excited to get in bed. Hope you guys enjoyed this week in my life. It had all kinds of things in it. Subscribe down below and I'll see you guys next time for our next video.